Hello, good evening, or good morning, good afternoon, depending on when and where you're watching this from. My name is Faye with Northern Red Fitness, and I thank you for joining us this evening. Please do check our Park Q form in the comment section just to make sure that you are healthy and ready for a new exercise program. Tonight's practice is going to be a gentle, calm, restorative practice, so we'll concentrate on just loosening up some of those major points of tension through the shoulders and neck, as well as through the low back and the hips. So to start, we're gonna take an easy seat. If you have a block or a pillow, something of the like, you can have a seat on that, or you can just sit down on the mat. The block is nice because it helps you to get those knees down just a little bit further. So if you feel comfortable, you can do that. Hands on the knees, and just Give a little wiggle out, making sure you are as comfortable as possible. Lifting up through the spine, lengthening through the crown of the head. Shoulders up, back and down. Relax the hands so they get nice and heavy. Deep breaths, inhaling all the way up. And exhale all the way down. Inhale, big deep breath. And exhale, fully releasing that breath out. Inhale, feeling that spine lengthen as you draw your breath in. Exhale, dropping the shoulders back and down. Once more, big inhale. And exhale, allowing that breathing just to happen naturally. Shoulders draw back, belly button in towards the spine. On an exhale, we're just gonna let the head rest over to one side, drawing the shoulders back and down. So left ear comes towards the left shoulders. Try to draw both shoulders down and away from the head, lengthening through the right side of the neck and into the shoulder. And a few deep breaths here. Every exhale gives us just a little bit more space. When you're ready, you can turn your gaze down towards that left knee, still keeping the shoulders down and back. Gently bring the head down towards center and over to that right side. So creating lots of space down the left side of the neck, shoulders back and down. Big deep breaths. Drawing those shoulders back. Drawing them down. On an exhale, turning the head down, looking towards that right knee. Your big deep breaths, trying to lengthen through the neck, through the shoulders. And exhale, allow the head to fall down through the center. And then over to the left side, taking just a few rolls side to side. Shoulders down and back, holding any position that feels like it might have just a little bit more tension to release. Ready on an inhale, coming all the way up. 
And exhale, rolling out through the shoulders. Take your left hand, placing it down beside the hip, big inhale, reaching up and over with that right side, holding it here for a few breaths, really thinking about opening up through that side body, through the ribs, trying to stack the shoulders, lengthen through that right arm, over the ear, slow, deep breath. On your next inhale, coming all the way up and over to the other side. Again, lengthening through that side body, reaching that arm over top. Strong, deep breaths, creating space through the ribs with every inhale. Reaching that left arm over the head. Inhale, coming all the way up and rolling out through the shoulders. Big inhale, hands reach up top. On an exhale, we turn to the left, right hand to left knee, opening up through the collarbone, lengthening shoulder blade to shoulder blade, creating a nice big twist, but ensuring that we still are able to fill the belly, the ribs, the lungs with each breath. On an inhale, reaching up. And exhale to the other side. Left hand to right knee, lengthening through the collarbone. Draw the shoulders back and down and ensure a nice strong deep breath. center, coming out of that twist, and just rolling up through the shoulders. Exhale. Big inhale, hands on either knee. On an exhale, we're going to sweep the chest down all the way around, inhaling up the other direction. And then on our exhale, coming down through the right and all the way up to the left. Alternating side to side. Finding lots of length through the spine. Holding any position that you might feel needs just a little bit more attention. And when you're ready, bringing it in center, hands down, and slowly melt your way forward. Holding as far down as you feel comfortable, relaxing through the shoulders, relaxing the head and the neck. And inhale, coming all the way back out, rolling out through those shoulders, and we'll extend the legs forward. We're going to stop first just with the knees bent, coming off your block or your pillow. So the knees bent and just dropping them down side to side. Shoulders back and down, nice and open through the chest. Good, 
good. Bringing it in, lengthening to the legs, heels down, toes in. Big inhale here, reaching up. Exhale, reaching forward. So hands come to the thighs, the shin, or maybe down to the toes. Reaching the belly button first, down towards the thighs, shoulders back and down, and again, lengthening through that spine. Softly melting towards the floor. Finding length through the hamstrings and through the back of the knees. Exhale gets us just a little bit deeper. On an inhale, coming up nice and easy, rolling out through those shoulders. We're going to take our right leg and bend it back. And then bring that left foot in so that the foot matches that right knee. Hands on the far side above the left thigh. So we're in a nice position here, resting our weight on the left hip. Both feet towards the right side, hands towards the left. Big inhale. And exhale, lower down. Inhale, lifting up. Exhale, lower down. Inhale, lift. And exhale. Let's hold this one down so you can come down onto the elbows if you like. Try to press that right hip around. On an inhale, rising up. Back in the center. We'll swap the feet around. Left leg goes back, right leg tucks in. Hands on the right side this time. Big breath in. Exhale, lower down to the right side. Launch the wall here. Big inhale up. And exhale, lower. Inhale up, and exhale. Inhale, and exhale. Coming down and holding it low. Try to keep the shoulders even. Exhaling, sending that breath all the way down into the hips. Inhale, coming back up. And rolling up through those shoulders. Coming onto the hands and knees here. Nice flat back. So our hands are underneath the shoulders, knees underneath the hips. On an inhale, we're gonna come up to a cow, arcing the back down, lifting the chin. Exhale, rounding up through the back. Inhale. And exhale. Inhale to cow. And exhale. 
Good, nice flat back. Soft wiggle out through the hips. We're gonna walk those hands out just a little bit further in front. Keep the hips over the knees and gently melt down through the hips. Relaxing the head, the neck to the floor. Nice big arch through the spine as we lower down into melted heart. So our aim here is to bring that chest down to the floor as low as you feel comfortable. Taking some deep breaths. Lengthen through the fingertips. on an inhale, coming back up, placing the hands in line with the shoulders, pressing through the entire hand, so the fingertips, the knuckles, as well as the palm, tuck the toes under in the back, and on an inhale, we're going to lift up and shift the hips back in a downward facing dog. Now feel free to bend the knees here. Our goal is to try to bring the belly button towards the thighs. Head between the arms, lengthen through the side body. Every exhale gets us just a little deeper. the shoulders, a little sway through the hips, and then we're going to bring a big hand up on the right side. Exhale, sweep it through, and reach it under the left arm. So our right shoulder's down on the floor, use that left hand to press into the floor, getting into a simple twist through the back, trying to stack the shoulders, maintaining our deep breath. On an inhale, rising up to the hands. Exhale, a little shake out. Inhale, reaching that left hand all the way up. And then exhale, sweeping it through the right. So left shoulder down, try to press that right shoulder back up. Maintaining a nice deep breath. Hips stay over the knees, resist the urge to press the hips one way or the other. Deep belly breaths. Gently bringing it back up. Big toes together, knees separate. We're going to sit back on the hips and reach the hands forward, relaxing into our child's pose. Soften through the shoulders, lengthen through the fingers. Gently just releasing the back and the hips. Taking a few moments 
to really connect again with our breath. Notice how our thoughts, our mind, and our heart all slow, become more at peace. As we slow down the rate of our breath. Inhaling slow, filling all the way up. And exhaling. All the way down. Big inhale, filling the belly through the ribs, all the way up to the top of the lungs. And then exhale all the way down, deep into the belly, squeezing through that belly button. tabletop. A little shake out through the hips and then bring it around onto your seat. Hands on the knees. Let's just take a few more big sweeps all the way around noticing maybe how we're a little less tight through the hips, through the glutes and the low back. Should feel a little softer through the shoulders and the neck. Inhaling all the way up into center. And exhale, settling down into that seat. Big inhale, reaching all the way up, palms together and exhaling down in the heart center. I'd like to thank you for joining me and sharing your practice with me. It's always a pleasure to have you. If you have any questions or comments, please do leave them below. Otherwise, I wish you a wonderful rest of your day. Thank you. Namaste. Thank you.